I always do videos telling you on how you should adapt your wardrobe to your new life changes. And today I would like to show you how I've transitioned my own to a more suitable summer capsule wardrobe. This summer was very different for me. As you might know, I've moved to Lisbon, Portugal, and I'm very happy about it. The only thing is that I most probably need to adjust my wardrobe to a new climate and the lifestyle in the upcoming season. The weather here is very different from what I had in Germany. It's warm, dry and sunny every day in Lisbon, while in Germany it is rarely warm, mostly cloudy or rainy. A few months before the big move, the first thing I did was take a closer look at my visual guide from last year's capsule to see what I had and what I could adjust. Even if this is not your case, any type of life change might make you consider using the tips in this video to do your own wardrobe transition and adapt it properly. You might have changed jobs, gained or lost weight, or maybe you are planning for an upcoming season. The most obvious thing you can start with is laying out all your clothes and shoes and doing an assessment. For example, I've noticed that most of my bottoms were long pants and I had only one pair of shorts. That, I thought, might be a problem. Another problem was that I knew that some of my older pieces were no longer wearable. You will probably see this with some of your wardrobe pieces as well. This white dress didn't fit me anymore and these two dresses were stained and I couldn't revive them. These green and camel t-shirts were also just too old and had some discoloration already. So all these items had to be replaced, otherwise I wouldn't have enough to wear. When you see this, Note how many items you can't wear anymore and set them aside. This number of items you are looking to replace is very important as it will influence the number of outfits you can create for your upcoming capsule. And when choosing new items, remember that color, style and fit are very important and anything you add to your wardrobe should fit perfectly with your old garments. Besides my last year's summer capsule, I also checked my spring capsule to see if I could move some items into my summer wardrobe. Of course, I didn't have any shorts there, but I had some nice light cotton pullovers, this cotton striped shirt and this yellow blouse. I think I wore it more than anything. The sweaters are also quite handy now as it gets really windy here in the evening. At this point, I suggest you go back to your wardrobe to see what you can reuse from clothes you forgot you had or even didn't think you might need for this upcoming capsule wardrobe. I'm sure you will find some treasures that will cut your spendings. So the new items I added before I moved were one shirt, one summer dress, two pairs of shorts and a pair of white leg denim pants. These shorts are more appropriate to wear in the city. I love to pair them with the new shirt for a more sporty look. And the other pair of shorts are much lighter and it's best to wear them to the beach or just around the house. I also decided to add a very casual pair of light jeans. Even though I had a lot of long pants in my capsule already, they were all way too fancy. I needed something much 
much more casual for days when I had to pack, move boxes, carry them and then unpack, all that moving fun stuff. Practicality is something you need to keep in mind no matter what type of capsule transition you are currently considering. Depending on your personal needs, I would say you need anywhere between two to five practical outfits. Once I arrived in Portugal, I added two more pieces from one of my favorite shops in Lisbon, where they sell clothing and shoes from local and small ethical brands. So the first piece was this mustard jumpsuit. I think it's the perfect everyday item. I love to wear it with my hat and sandals to go explore the sunny city. I actually already had a similar jumpsuit, but it has much longer pants, thicker fabric and longer sleeves. So I will just keep it for the autumn season instead. You will also find the wardrobe pieces that might be more suitable for a future capsule wardrobe. So don't be shy, set them aside and make a mental note. The second piece I added was this amazing dress. It's from a local designer, Benedita Formosino. I love the structure, the pleated detail, open back and strong shoulders. I love to wear it when I have private consultations with my clients. I feel beautiful in it. It's a confidence booster. Do you have any pieces that make you feel the same? You will need some outfits that will elevate your mood and make you feel special. So consider that as well. My updated summer capsule now consists of nine tops, eight bottoms, four dresses, one jumpsuit, one blazer, three pairs of shoes, two bags and one city backpack. When I mix all these items together, I get at least 70 outfits. That's a good number of outfits for my new lifestyle needs. So far, I'm very satisfied with my capsule. I am wearing everything and never feel bored with it. Even my longer pants are useful. I usually wear them in the evening when um, we go for a walk or for a late dinner. Oh yes, and I also added a few accessories. I went to a local flea market, which is situated in the old city district called Alfama. And I found this gorgeous bag that I thought would be great as a beach bag or even a city bag when I need to carry a lot of stuff like a camera, microphones, a water bottle and so on. In the same market, I also spotted this cute brush and of course I couldn't resist buying it. I can't imagine how many accessories you will need. That's up to your needs and personal style. If you are unsure about your personal style or how to accessorize, I would suggest taking the Style Harmony class. It will show you what your personal style is and how to bring it to life. I will keep this summer capsule as it is at least until October, I think, and then I will slowly start transitioning into the next season. I'm actually very curious to see how the autumn looks and feels here and I can't wait to adjust my capsule appropriately. Let me know in the comments how your summer wardrobe worked for you and how you would like to improve it next year. Let's discuss and learn from each other. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. If you did, please don't forget to share it with your friends, subscribe to my channel and press like so other people can also find it here on YouTube. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.